Universe Ticket is a crazy roller coaster which is making viewers go insane because such good vocalists are having an unfair treatment on the show. Like Vanessa who ranked first on voting despite having less talent. Yes, she is the one who sang the rap part in Wonder Girls' Tell Me. Judges thought that she's only lacking in rapping part, but that was later proved wrong when she covered Ace Stacy's song. In fact, many talented contestants also had to leave the show because of unfair treatment from judges including Vula. Lindan, Real, Alyssa, Alicia, Jelly, and Aya. However, these girls had huge support from their native countries. Viewers are outraged over all social media platforms, defending their countries and giving statements for the contestants. For example, one of the Thai viewers mentioned how Universe Ticket is so unpopular in their country that SBS didn't put it on airing, on YouTube, or any other streaming sites for them to vote. In the episode 3 of Universe Ticket, the four teams competed against one another including Enchanting Challengers who chose Diva by After School and Enchanting Winners who chose Mr. by Kara. Now, even though the judges did not completely let down the contestants, they did what felt right to them and chose the Enchanting Challengers as the winners due to their impeccable stage presence and high energy. The viewers were a bit disappointed due to the performance of Enchanting Winners even though the lineup looked really good for them. On the other hand, Enchanting Winners had to face criticism or fear feedback, especially from Hyoyeon, who said that none of them were memorable while performing. She also mentioned that their performance felt like they didn't practice together, since there was no harmony among the contestants and the other judges agreed with Hyoyeon as well. Moving on to the next team, the Team Pure Challengers who chose Achu by Lovelies. Even though their overall performance was cute and pure just like their theme, but they made a few mistakes here and there, especially with Minju, who forgot the lyrics to the song which kind of ruined their performance and resulted in their loss. On the other hand, Team Pure winners who chose Into the New World by Girls Generation received positive feedback from the most experienced idol judge on the show, Hyoyeon. She was really impressed by Gyoryeon's pure energy that she put into dancing on Into the New World. Sejo on the other hand picked Sunwoo and said that even if she made a mistake on stage, she must never show it to the general public. We all know that idols cover their mistakes on stage very naturally, so that's probably what Sejong was trying to tell her. But overall, the judges were satisfied with their performance so they won against the Team Pure challengers. The vocalists were also really strong in the Team Pure. Exactly how the vocalists should be when it comes to the Korean Pure concepts in different songs. So they absolutely slayed the performance. From their strong vocals to their dance break, it was a worthy performance to be shown before Hyoyeon, who served as the main dancer in Girls Generation. Moving on to the next team, we have Sparkling Winners, who performed Red Flavor by Red Velvet with Alicia serving as the highlight with the very first line. Alicia herself said that her strong point was with her smile and eyes which she could really pull off on stage. The judges put an emphasis on how this team's contestants have improved so much as compared to the one-on-one -on -one battle, making them wonder if they were the same contestants. Since Sparkling Challengers who chose Dolphin by Oh My Girl also made a deep impact on the judges, their evaluation was really hard to put forward. However, Team Sparkling challengers end up winning the competition due to their unmatched talent and stage presence which resembled other K-pop idols. Now the real question arises, what will happen to the teams that have lost? Well, all members of the losing teams would have to earn tickets from fans to be able to advance to the universe. There was another last round of revenge battle between the charismatic challengers and charismatic winners. Both teams were up to something and they were really determined to win. The charismatic challengers chose fire by 21 and they really did put fire fire on the stage with their fierce appearance, strong vocals, and even lit dance performances. The judges liked their performance, but they preferred choosing charismatic winners who chose Do 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 by Blackpink, and each of the contestants stood out while performing. Sejong complimented each of the contestants and told them about their strengths and how well they all performed together. When it was the time to select the winning team, judges got quite concerned and confused since both teams performed really well. However, at the end, they selected charismatic winners as the winners. Yes, they outdid themselves with each contestant standing out well. However, there are surely some viewers who disagree with the winners of the charismatic challenge saying that their performance was just okay-ish. Some viewers find it a bit amusing that the three Koreans were duking it out over a leadership with a whole bunch of foreigners just watching the drama unfold. Poor Jayla and Nana caught in the crossfire of leadership roles. Tears and confusions definitely add an extra layer of drama to the whole survival. 
survival show. The battle week began with 82 contestants, but only 41 of them could advance to the universe. Then the judges had to decide who would advance to the universe through the unicorn ticketing. They selected specific contestants from the sparkling team to advance to the universe. The selected members were Lee Yun Tae, Kim Soo Bin, Gotoko, and Hwang Si Yun. The four contestants that were not selected by them would get a chance to get to the universe through fan ticketing with the losing teams. Next, the winning team of Cute Concept came on stage, out of which only Lim So Won, Gabby, Yuri, and Nako got selected. Moving onwards to the enchanting team who performed Diva, out of which Oh Yu Na, Chang Sua, Idota Yui, and Chon Jin Young. Then it was time to select the contestants of Pure Concept. The judges selected Bang Yun Ha, Gu Gyo Ryeon, Lee Hu Ran, and Lee Sun Woo. Lastly, the judges selected Bae Ye Ram, Mizi, Kim Soo Jin, and Jayla. Just like that, the 20 girls who made it to the universe were announced while the remaining 21 girls will be decided by fan ticketing or through the global votes. Shortly after, the girls who were selected through fan ticketing were announced. It included Jelly, Bae Haram, Nana, Kim Soo Min, Oh Da Yun, Cho Hye Narumi, Real, Minari, and many more made it through the fan ticketing, joining the other girls for a whole new beginning. What surprised everyone was the farewell of two girls who eventually made it through the universe by the fan ticketing system. However, they decided to leave the show. These girls were Alyssa and Nachayathon, who pulled out of the show due to personal reasons. Meanwhile, the other selected contestants watched the universe open right in front of their eyes. They explained that the universe has five classes. Prism. While explaining that all all of the contestants are in the same class, M, right now, they also explained that only 8 members would have the potential to move all the way up to the P class, acquiring the PRISM ticket and debut. At last, they explained that the contestants would be able to move to class P by unicorn ticketing and fan ticketing. If the contestants are able to acquire these tickets, they will be able to move up to 2-3 classes at once and the moment they reach class P, they are all set to debut. The pressure is mounting in the universe ticket competition competition as the charismatic winners group finds themselves entangled in a web of leadership disputes. With five foreigners and three Koreans vying for control, the atmosphere is thick with tension, leaving Jayla and Nana bewildered and caught in the emotional crossfire. The stakes are high and their dreams of debuting as a global girl group are hanging in the balance. As the show progresses, the girls realize that survival is not just about individual talent, it's about teamwork and unity. The challenges escalate from intense one-on-one -on -one battles to demanding group performances pushing the contestants to their limits. The relentless nature of universe ticket leaves no room for complacency. The girls have to work harder than ever to prove themselves on the global stage.